Hi friends, God bless, God bless. How are you? I hope you're having a lovely day. Amen. We're gonna jump back into Psalms 119 and get some more verses in tonight. Amen. So tonight we're gonna start on verse um <clears throat> excuse me 65 and I'm gonna read up to 88. Amen. I might go further. Let's just see how it goes. Amen. All right, let's give the Lord thanks before we start reading. Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you. I thank you for this word tonight. I thank you, um, Father. May you just continue to give us the wisdom, Father, to understand your word and open up our hearts and minds to, to receive to receive this reading tonight. And we thank you, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 So I'm going to read this in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. And it says, <clears throat> Thou hast dealt well with thy servant, O Lord, according unto thy word. Teach me good judgment and knowledge, for I have believed thy commandments. Before I was afflicted, I went astray, but now have I kept thy word. Thou art good and doest good. Teach me thy statutes. <clears throat> the proud have have um, forged a lie against me, but I will keep thy precepts in my whole, with my whole heart. Their heart is as fat as grease, but I delight in thy law. It is good for me that I have been afflicted, that I might learn thy statutes. The law of thy mouth is better unto me than a thousand of gold and silver. Thy hands have made me and fashion me, give me understanding that I may learn thy commandments. They that fear thee will be glad when they see me, because I have hoped in thy word. I know, O Lord, that thy judgments are right, and that thou that thou is thou in faithfulness hast afflicted me. <clears throat> Let I pray thee. Thy merciful kindness be for my comfort according to thy word unto thy servant. Let thy tender mercies come upon me that I may live, for thy law is my delight. Let the proud be ashamed, for thy death dealt previous, previously with me without a cause, but I will meditate in thy precepts. Let those that fear thee Turn unto me, and those that know thy testimonies. Let my heart be sound in thy statutes, that I be not ashamed. <clears throat> my soul fainteth for thy salvation, but I hopeth in thy word. My eyes fail for thy word, saying, When wilt thou comfort me? For I am be become like a bottle in the smoke yet do i not forget thy statutes how many are the days of thy servant when wilt thou execute judgment of them that persecute me the proud have digged pits for me which are not after thy law all thy commandments are faithful they persecute me wrongfully help on me they had almost consumed me upon earth, but I forsook not thy precepts. Quicken me after thy loving kindness, so shall I keep thy testimony of thy mouth. Amen, amen. Glory to God, hallelujah. Amen. Amen, amen. Hallelujah. So the psalmist writes from experience. Um, he had previously gone astray and now <clears throat> and knew what it was like to be out of favor with God. I had, um, it had ultimately um, become a positive experience for him because after he returned to the Lord, he realized what was really important. Afterward, he wouldn't have traded his commandment to God's laws for silver or gold. He also acknowledges God as his creator 
and wants to spread his spend his life <clears throat> telling others about the Lord, offering them truth and hope. The psalmist admits to experiencing um, periods where he didn't feel the comfort or the presence of God. <clears throat> his spiritual condition began to get dry and brittle like a bottle in the smoke. But during such times, he remained patient and persevering. Faithfully looking and longing for the promises of God to return. Amen. Amen. That is the reading for tonight, guys. Um, blessings, 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 guys. Amen. Um, <clears throat> I was debating to read a little bit extra tonight, but I'm going to end it there. Let's meditate on this word. Um, reread it. Amen. Glory to God. Let's give thanks. <clears throat> Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this word that was presented tonight. We thank you for, for guiding us through this reading and blessing our ears with your word, Father. Another day, another night, we thank you, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, amen. Amen, friends. God bless you. Blessing, as always, to read with you. Um, I pray this edified you um, and opened up your mind um to the word of god amen um <clears throat> again meditate on it if you like this video hit the like button and share the gospel guys um glory to god we never know who needs to hear the words of the lord amen um <clears throat> again thank you for watching thank you for for reading with me and giving god time amen and helping yourself grow by listening to the word of god Amen. As always, God bless you today, tomorrow, forever. Amen. God bless, friends. Bye.